the book Dragon Slayer. Hello. Come, sit with me, friend. Mm -hmm. Who am I? Ah, right. You don't know me. A lot of people don't know me nowadays. Which is ironic, considering it was William Langland who mentioned me in one of his poems. Pyre's Plowman, I believe. Mm hmm. <laughs> the very same. I am the virtue of patience. It is my name, it is what I am, and it is who I am. And it is wonderful to meet you. How do I know your name? Oh, my sister spoke of you. Mm hmm. Humility and kindness. They spoke fondly of you, considering that they visited you prior. What do I know? I know a lot of things. And you are feeling quite negatively, aren't you? You're upset about a lot of things. Why don't you tell me? Come and sit with me. I won't judge you. My sisters do not judge you, and nor will I. <sighs> Trust. I am a virtue. I cannot lie. There. Now, tell me, what is it that has been bothering you? Ah, uh, looking forward to getting that internship. Mm hmm. Rough day at the academy. Mm hmm. And you lost your date to the dance. Ah, uh, yikes. Well, sometimes you just have to be patient. I know, it's easier said than done. But it's better than lashing out at others. Speak from experience. Well, I have been angry before, but I do not lash out at others, or at myself, or at the items around me. Oftentimes, whenever I get angry, I will write in my journal, or I will work on an art piece, and my anger is turned into something beautiful. It's used for good. But I can understand your frustrations. Well, as I'm sure kindness and humility told you, as virtues, we offer advice. And I may not have all the experiences of a human, but I do know a thing or two. I know quite a bit. And I trust you. You have a good, decent head on your shoulders. My sisters have always been good judges of character. Even, even humility, though she won't admit it. She has a very big heart. But I do know this. Look, look at me. This situation, all of your situations that you have told me, could turn out one of three ways. One, you get what you want. Two, you do not get what you want. Or three, 
you get what you want just later on down the line. And sometimes when you do not get what you want, that usually means that there is something a lot better waiting for you on the other side of things. <laughs> well, I have been doing this since time began. <laughs> Me and my sisters. How many more of us are there? So there's seven of us in total. Will you get the chance to meet the rest of them? Oh, if you have been visited by my sister Humility, and then by my sister Kindness, and then by me, I think it's safe to say that you're going to be visited by the others. What are they like? Well, if I told you, it would spoil the surprise, now wouldn't it? <laughs> True, but still. It's fun, don't you think? To get surprises on occasion? I know it's frustrating. But again, sometimes you just need to step back and breathe a bit and then approach the situation calmer. And again, you might get what you want, you might not, or you might get it later on down the line. I know lots of things, but I can't read into the future. That is beyond me. So, you will simply have to be patient. What would I suggest? Well, your poetry is very good. And your grades are good. Maybe trying something new to take your mind off it while you wait. There are lots of ways that you can pass the time by while being patient. Listen. At the end of the day, I can't tell you what to do. Neither me nor my sisters can. You ultimately make the choice here. We can give you advice, but that is all we can do. Offer advice, and it is up to you and only you if you decide to take it or not. I know this, though. You are... A charming, kind, loyal, wonderful, generous, and honest individual. You are hardworking, and you are reliable. You are good company, not just as a friend, but as family. And of course you know that I am not the only one offering you support and advice. My sisters are humility and kindness, but your friends and your family love you dearly. They want what's best for you, and they are supporting you every step of the way. I would just like you to think about that for a bit. You are a good person, and even if you do not get what you want, there may be something better on down the road for you. I don't know. But again, I know that you are a good human. You are wonderful, creative, and imaginative, and kind, and an honest friend. Mm. Pardon me. I ate some of Kindness's cooking before I came. Mm -hmm. She does make the best food in the entire world. Do I cook? On occasion, I mostly just tend to our garden, with the help of my sister, of course, especially during the summer season, when the grapes are full and it's time to make wine. <laughs> uh, you haven't met her yet, but I think you're really going to like my other sisters. This one especially, she's certainly an absolute character.
Hmm? Will you ever see me again? Perhaps. I often appear to those who are often fuming, not acting upon their anger, but certainly stewing on it. And oftentimes, if you don't let go of your anger, it has a tendency to control you. It's not a pretty sight. But that is my advice to you. Just think about it, all right? <laughs> I have to leave now. But farewell, good human. And I wish you all the best. <laughs>